Hello guys, in this video we are going to discuss about tangent to a circle. First of all, what is tangent? It is a line that intersects the circle at only one point. Here we have a circle and we have a line AB which is intersecting at only one point that is C. So here AB is considered as a tangent. Now if I tilt this line towards this side, this side it will become like this. Now this line has two point of contacts. One is C here and here let's consider this as a C dash. And we already know that the line which has two point of contact on circle is considered as a secant. And if I tilt this little more, it will become like this. Let's consider as a C double dash. And if tilt it a bit more, then it will become C triple dash. And if you tilt it more, then it will become like this. And if you observe here, while I am tilting this line towards this side, every time the distance between the contact point that is C and C dash and C double dash, every time the distance is increasing. With this, we can say that we cannot draw more than one tangent from a point on circle. Here, at this point, we can draw only one tangent that is AB. And we can also say that tangent is nothing but a special case of secant where the two contact points are coinciding with each other. Here, if you see, this is secant. Let's consider as a M and N. And if we observe one by one here, every time the distance between this C point and this contact point is decreasing. Here it is more, here it is decreasing and decreasing. At one particular point, these two inter intersecting points are coinciding with each other. At that time, it becoming tangent. So based on this, we can conclude that tangent is a special case of secant where two intersecting points coincide with each other. Coming to the, our next case, here a circle is given with a center O and here a line is given that is AB which has two point of contacts. It means that AB is a secant. And now if I start drawing parallel line to this line towards downward direction, we will draw like this. This line also has two point of contacts, point 0.1 and point 0.2 and coming to this line also has two point of contacts, point 0.1 and point 0.2, this one also. But at one particular point, you will get a line which has only one point of contact. Let's consider this line as a M and N. The line MN has only one point of contact. For that reason, it is considered as a tangent. And if I repeat the same process towards upward direction, we'll get another second over here, we'll get another second and at one particular point, we'll get a line which has only one point of contact. Let's consider this line as a P and Q. This line also has only one point of contact. For that reason, this PQ also considered as a tangent. So, based on this information, we can conclude that there cannot be more than two tangent which are parallel to the given second, that is AB. Tutorialspoint.com Simply easy learning.